Well, I want to be re gonna be re re repairing this chair today. Over the years, these things come loose. You know, people sitting on them, moving around, whatnot, and that, and it breaks the the glue joints loose. So we got to pull it apart. Plus, some of the screws have fallen out. See, well. I've worked it enough to where I've pretty much got that loose so it should come right on apart now. But uh, see some of the screws, what's happened is screws come out, it starts wiggling around, working the glue joints loose. That's what causes a lot of the problems. Uh, we got the front part. There's the back part, so we just got to get some glue and a bunch of screws. I took one out earlier. I've got one that's a hair bit too short. And the next side that I got is too long, so what we'll do is we'll just take the long ones, just cut them off. It seems like I've always either got too short or too long of whatever. Anyway, we'll go ahead and cut the screws off first so we'll get the right length. I'll figure out how many we need because I want to be able to glue it and screw it together before the glue sets up. Then we'll just let it set. So there's really not that much to it. All right, I got a couple of new screws. I one on each side, one there, and one right there. And then as soon as I get it together, then I'll put one in the back. Put one in the back back there. But I got to get the front on first. Don't want to tighten everything up till I get the front on. So now let's exclude everything and slide her together. And get some screws in there. Let that kind of drill down in there. Still do the same thing up here. Put a little bit in on both sides of these. What I mean is spread apart. And so we've got to be able to, I got to get a clamp across there to pull that in before that sets up. I mean, this chair here is probably over 50 years old. We've got these two side ones in. We can pull our clamp off because it's been on here for about 15 minutes. Now we'll just get us a wet rag, just wipe down our, our uh, get our glue off of there.
Don't want to make it look too new. I know I've changed the the seat cover on this thing three times. And that's been over over 30 years. And of course, her mom had it 20, 30 years before that, so and I'm sure she changed it a couple of times. So this is one of those one of those good chairs you just never want to get rid of. Alright, well have fun repairing your chairs.